we're picking his brains to make sure that we put the right, you know, uh, format clauses and stuff like that. And uh, he's been a great, uh, you know, supporter of uh, IESA as well as Netra, uh, and many more expected. Right. So that's that's where I will stop. And then the, the next slide. <coughs> okay. How is this problem solved across the world? Leave it to the problem solvers. So I think I'll, I have talked about it. So uh, Stanford worked for US. I make it is not listed here, but for Europe, uh, I think it's there. Yeah, Europe, Taiwan called Italy, and they started Italy. Six acre land. We'll talk about more detail there. Korea, on based on Italy, they say Etri, E T R I, Electronics Technology Research Institute. All of them had similar model. Okay, but it's just scales was different, and some customized was there. So we picked up the most closest and most relevant model to work on. So we basically realized that ITRI model of Taiwan is working well. Next slide. So six acre acre land. So this is important for us. We are not going to have 1,000 acre cut of a Stanford campus. It will take another 10 years to get 1,000 acre with the current law of the land, law, land selling and transfer, transfer law going on, right? So six acres land, started as R&D hub, 73 started. Transform labor intensive economy into this one as well. TSMC, UNC came out of that. The idea, some kind of things came out of that. 2000 plus patents have been commercialized. Imagine how many patents would be there. 2400 or something, 300 patents. They have sold it to the local industry to make commercial made. $450 million revenue. 5000 employees currently. 140 CEOs have come out of that company. High tech CEOs, company CEOs. Six acre land, maybe few hundreds of millions of dollars. That's all, not billion dollars. And what is the key thing? They integrated research for production, training, and incubation. <coughs> Integrate that under one building. And what we are doing in India? Like a cobbler in one region, businessman in one region, in another region, right? Same way, we have three people, three different. They are all king of their own areas, but they are not working together. Not a the Indians, we are not working as a team. That's the biggest challenge you're going to have this in Nitra. If you don't work as a team, you are screwed up. So we want to start small. Customized for India. People work into team when 10, 10, 20 people are there. How many people we don't work as a team? So let's work with 10, 20 people initially and see who kind of grows up to become a team player at a bigger level. Go forward. So four pillars are going to be success and we have, we have been trying to identify people for that. We identified few people. So there are no job openings for all of them. Some of them are opening. So, and we talk about Technology and product research, we don't have anybody today. Okay. There's one person we are talking to in Boston who has 17 years of experience in Silicon Labs. He's interested to come back. And we are looking at maybe how to kind of get him the funding so that he can come back to Bhumne, his home, Bhumne, uh, Orissa. ESDM capacity building, Purnima. Purnima, please raise your hand. She has been, so we joined together in DI at the same day. And we are working in DI for 16 years. Then she started her company, I started my company. Now, she has got passionate about online education and transforming uh, education through online technology. And India needs that scaling. So she has already got a platform working on it and she's working on it. She will be the person who will drive that vertical. Incubation, we didn't have anybody till yesterday. And that person has still not accepted it because we don't have any offer in hand. But I have talked to, where is the, Jiten. I didn't say <coughs> So this is, I mean, I'm embarrassing you, Jitin. But he's the guy who has done, yeah. who has been uh, Bell, then uh, Motorola, and uh, then uh, HP. HP, and multiple startups, and then kind of a, he's actually kind of a guiding startups actually. And one of the startups he guided has got funding of two hundred thousand dollars. And his only passion, I asked him, what do you want? What do you expect from this? He said, I I love doing products. So anything you tell me, tell me to do products, then it works. Don't try to try, try, try to tell me sell this, sell that, do that. So and that that's all. That's all I need. He said. Okay. So I'm uh, verbally publicly saying he's one of the guy offer he has to respond to offer back or not that's his choice. I just got to know him yesterday, but we clicked within half an hour thanks to Venki. No, you can't refuse. <laughs> and India Chip program, I'm not going to talk about it now, but this person has actually created India Chip unique first time in India ever done. Okay. A chip taped out and I'll not steal the thunder, so you listen to it and then maybe if I get a chance. I'll talk about it. That's the person. Okay, so go forward. Uh, no, I think go, this is all right. So we need to have all these four pillars actually working stronger, working 
alone but interdependent. Independent and interdependent. Then only we can make this building succeed. And that's what we want to do. Netra is what we want to make success by these four pillars. Each one has its stand. stand. So most important is India chip program. Because if you don't have IP in semiconductor, there's no chip we can do ever in the world in India. So without India chip program, where hundreds of colleges are doing chips every year, and we actually got kind of IP created, which is local, which is available for kind of uh, entrepreneurs to create chips out of it. This is going to be a disaster. So this is what is the most critical. And Munal Das is going to talk about his experience on the Indian chip program. And uh, take it forward. Go forward. <coughs> Starfish model. Don't want to spend much time. Idea is basically there will be no head office. We start with centers across India. Whichever center actually kind of assumes the bigger father role, bigger brother role, philanthropic role, altruistic role, and not getting ego and saying I will help everybody, bring everybody on the table, they become the head office. So that is basically kind of organically. And if you cut the head, starfish, the starfish becomes actually it develops its heads also and creates two starfish. We'll cut another one into four starfish. So we want actually kind of hundreds of starfish in India, and that's why that model will be there. Go forward. Four programs, go forward. Time is not there. So I think this model is not a problem. So what you can contribute? Okay, you will say, hey, Vivek, I cannot do my job. I love this job. I love to come in Monday morning. And I can spend Saturday sometimes. I love this education, but not as much as I love my job and my family. You can define the curriculum for ASDM for some subject. Be part of that team. Record lectures if you are a good teacher and you want to love like recording, record lectures. Defining industry projects, create list of those projects. Assessment of the partners we want to have. We don't want to do anything internally. We want to identify three, four training partners, rank them, assess them regularly, and give the list to the colleges. Colleges decide whom they work with. We'll identify some of the incubation companies who are doing good job, identify them, assess them, so you can be one of the assessors. Mentoring projects and incubating them. <coughs> or mentoring incubators, not just the students. Internship, etc. Lot can be done, but the challenge comes today is that how will you get the chip experience? And how will this incubation work in the campus? Campus may a company come so the day they succeed, they want to get out of campus. How will they continue in the campus? Infrastructure nahi rehta hai, kids are not there, employees don't want to stay in the campus. Any company becomes successful has to be out of campus. So first problem answer will be given by Murdal. And second answer will be given by Professor Shattar, who has created magic in his campus. And he will talk during the panel discussion how it can happen. That's all I have. I'll hand off to Murdal. He is my, uh, he, he was in TI, so he joined Sankal Semiconductor. Uh, uh, 10 years back, he was one of the co-founders, uh, and uh, he has been passionately working since, because he is in Bhubdeshwar, <coughs> there is no travel, he is so fed up that there is no travel, he decided to work on the India chip program in a part time, and he made that happen, so. Yeah, thanks, thanks Vivek, I think knowing Vivek for 20 years, he takes all the time, if there is any schedule, <laughs> that <laughs> schedule goes for a pass, so <laughs> done successfully. So we'll we'll go to the next slide. We'll go to the next slide. So the purpose of India Chip Program is, um, if you look at it, to create a platform. As we said, that chip as such is not there. So it's not about which chip we are creating here. It's not about what is the most exciting and what is the most kind of relevant chip at this point of time. But the last one and a half year, we are working just to create the platform which is scalable, and that is how this becomes one of the founding portion of the uh, Netra platform. So the goal of uh, India Chip is to create a nationwide academic platform uh, for chip development under co-guidance from industry. What When we started finding what are the different um, uh, chips which has been created, there are lots of chips which is created. One problem is it doesn't go to the productization. The kind of issues that we are finding, it is not about making the product, but it is about ability to solve the productization issues. That has been missing in almost all academic platforms that we have studied and uh, in the last several years. And the other thing is the industry's participation is always there, but it has been mostly in a social service model. It's not really in a co-guidance where the review and the, the best practices are shared right from day one till the end, end of the day. Right? So these are the two basic differentiation we are bringing and ensure the quality and capability towards the chip productization. So the status, in a very brief way, uh, we have successfully did the first ever chip with actually these three, two to three colleges working together and the industry review. Again, the foundation here is 
two or three colleges together. I, I mean, just like industries working together becomes difficult, sometimes academic institutes working together is also equally difficult, right? So that is a challenge and that gives us enough confidence that now that we have done with two, three colleges, having 10, 15 colleges working together is also possible if we do in a planned and structured manner. Chip characterization, which is a very, very important portion. A lot of times, especially the Indian ecosystem, the way the semiconductor ecosystem has come up is more tuned towards we'll do the design the right way, we'll do the other things the right way, but core productization without the chip characterization and the productization test, it is of no meaning. It actually doesn't go anywhere because the issues are very interlinked with each other. Uh, third is a central team, which is of some of these expertise. Instead of recreating everywhere, there is a central team already created, which will have some of this architecture level to the chip creation level expertise. And eventually it can go to the higher level of uh, excellence. And uh, finally, we have to start somewhere. So it's not about faculties are doing the best job or industries are doing the best job. That's not the, that's not the main thing. What we have found is there are enough industry people who has gone back to the faculty and they're desperate to do something more. So at least we have identified six, seven, eight such in industry people going back. And uh, in the last one year, at least try to tap the best of it, who are in the academic environment, but still has that, that feeling and connection to how to do the things in a project management, production management, and all these things in a planned plan manner. So if you go to the next slide, uh, this is, I mean, the extension of the status. The first chip, we actually named everything on the solar system, because I thought eight to nine years is good, and eight is the number of planets, so it's a solar system name. So the Mercury is the first chip. In industry term, we call it pipe cleaner. Essentially, we try to see the flow, that everything is there, we can work with the college, we, we have the basic needs taken care. So the Mercury chip pipe cleaner had power management, memory, and digital filter, just to make sure a start happened with that. Cadence and Mentor has come forward, and they are actually supporting very, very big way. They have kind of gone to the extent to the saying that this, since it's a national platform, we'll make sure this gets all the support, and almost from a CSR responsibility from an EDA partnership perspective. So we work in the highest level of EDA partnership there. Some of the first colleges which has worked, but the name doesn't matter here. As I said, here we are just putting a concept forward. So any name can come here. We are, we are absolutely academic partner agnostic and industry partner agnostic, right? So any industry partner and any academic partner is equally welcome, right? Um, of course, just because I was working in Sankar, I am working in Sankar, so the first industry partner, Sankal Semi, he has worked uh, to some extent. And uh, all these Netra partners which is coming on board has already started interacting. TI, Infiniant, Dissolve in a big way, and you will see some of those examples in the plans ahead. Um, incidentally, there are at least 10 colleges which has already come forward and saying and showing requests. I'll be happy if there are more requests. And we will see in a structured manner how Netra can address such interests. Uh, we will need full-time resources, and this is not possible without full-time effort. A part-time effort of doing the, doing the classes and part-time coming and solving this, it does not work. So the four full-time persons was engaged, and uh, Venus, which is the next chief which is going on, we do envision 10, 10 people working together. So the Venus platform has already started in some way. Um, essentially, it is a little larger version. It is a system on chip. There is a system. It's not a very big system. But it is working on IoT because one of the instructions that came from uh, ISA and uh, ESAC is focused on IoT and make sure all the research ideas as well as chips is focused on that. So IoT for agriculture is what we are focusing for Venice. More details will be shared with an appropriate uh, participations. What is the architecture, what is the chip and how it works and how it will also solve some of the India's current agricultural problem, right? Because if it doesn't connect to the present day problem, right. It is not just make in India, it has to be make for India also, right? So that's the bridge we are trying to connect here in the uh, in an environment. Some of the colleges which have started adding together, I already mentioned, and there are more things. As you see, it will convert from a chip to a platform level exercise. It is the platform which will look into one side, the systems, and one portion of the system will be the chip. System can be uh, any vendors or any chips can be part of that system, but one of those chips which will have a unique differentiation which will be coming from the India chip program. So that is the whole idea in a very nutshell.